Hi, welcome to New Lennox Now. I'm Rich Olowski, and I'm here with Jimmy Vanderlaan, local New Lennox resident and artist. Jimmy, thanks for coming along. Thanks, Rich. All right, I see you brought some of your artwork here, yeah. and uh, it's pretty interesting. It's not your normal artwork where you use a canvas. Can you tell us uh, what's the medium that you use and what metal are you using here? So these are aluminum panels. I get them in bulk and uh, set them up together and I use a grinder and I uh, pick various designs in a way that they catch the light. You know, if you move around, the light really makes them spin and, you know, look 3D and then some uh, automotive paints, pearls, clear coats, and this is what we end up with. Okay, what prompted you to get into this type of artwork to begin uh, with? Always been creative, always done the art thing. I did see some of this online, and um, then I saw one of my friends had it on his wall, actually, and I, I was looking at it, and I thought, you know, I, would, I think I could do this. So okay. I gave it a shot, and uh, I, I'm a pipe fitter by trade. So I work with grinders, I work with metal all the time. And uh, so it was almost second nature to me, you know. And then I just started trying it out, and then over and over again, a lot of fails, a lot of, I got quite a pile in the shop of uh, learning experiences. But um, eventually they started to look like something. Now, when you're, when you're doing all this grinding and stuff, is there, you know, in the painting, and what type of paint is being used here? Is it the, like uh, you're saying, automotive? That's an automotive paint, yeah. It's the you... same paint they use in automotive industry when okay. you see, like, those uh, high-end custom paint jobs and stuff. And uh, you do more than just probably these, as we're, we're looking right at here, you know, you got all these kind of spirally type, really yes. kind of beautiful yes. pieces of work here. Now, do you do other types of... Uh, uh, pictures? Do you do anything like a palm tree or anything along oh, those yeah. lines? Oh yeah, yeah. I, well, I started with uh, the, the bursts. That was like the first design I really kind of perfected or got happy with how it turned out. And then this, these spirals are actually Fibonacci spirals. They, okay. they are found in nature in uh, sunflowers, uh, cactuses, Pineapples, they all have that certain pattern, you know, you could see, and it's the same mathematic spiral okay. found everywhere. So I would have not thought that, but uh, yeah, these, these come out, these are very beautiful. I mean, you. I love the, the orange sunburst one right here. Thank you. Yeah, uh, that was like a fall, summer, fall inspired color scheme there. Uh, yeah, the palm trees you mentioned, uh, I had a few requests to do palm trees, so I uh, thought I'd give it a shot, and after two or three, I actually, I wish I had one here today, but uh, the palm tree and there's the water and the way that the grinding works with the different light, if you walk past it, it looks like there's waves in the water. And oh, it, that's it, pretty yeah, cool. Yeah, it, it turned out really cool. No. I mean, I notice as you walk by these, as um, you walk past them in the different light, it does look like they're, there's a little movement going on. Right, there. right, yeah. It's the refraction of the, the grind marks, the tiny little grind marks that you, you know, create this refraction. So when you walk by, the, the reflection of that light is just catching the different grinds and then reflects back at your eyeball. So that's what you see part of it, you know, as you walk past it. Now, uh, how do you, you know, uh, you have customers, correct, buying yes. this stuff? You yes. know, yeah. uh, what's the type of customers? Is it homeowners, businesses? Uh, well, it started out on Facebook. You know, I, I started sharing my artwork with my friends and my family, and then uh, people were, I got a lot of good feedback. And a lot of people were like, well, is that one for sale? I said, well, yes. So I just kept going, and I just listed them for sale, listed them for sale, and then every one of them was getting bought up I couldn't believe it so um, now I just it's getting into businesses I just had one sell for a real estate office and an insurance office um, I've, I'm in restaurants in uh, Dyer Indiana John's Pizzeria I have three pieces that are hanging up there if you ever happen to go to John's Pizza in Dyer okay um, 
yeah, and so now and I finally got the website up and going and the Instagram and connecting all the dots with that stuff. Okay. They look, they, if I look at this, I'm wondering, are these heavy or light? Very light. Very light. Aluminum. Very light. Um, okay. 063 of an inch thick. So okay. it's, it's like less than an eighth of an inch thick. So, so they're not like, it's not like I got to really like mount these on the wall using like no, lag bolts. No, no, no. Yeah, you had basic, uh, you know, picture hanging, you know, stuff that you can get at Lowe's or Home Depot. It's, it's pretty simple. Um, I do, the hangers are already mounted on the back. Okay. Uh, so you would just, you bend them out, you bend them down, and, and it just hangs right on the wall. Perfect. Yes. Beautiful. Beautiful work here. Thank I gotta you. say, I, I love you. seeing a lot of your work. I've seen it, much of your work uh, before, and I think it's great. Um, I'm glad you could come out here. Yeah. Is there a way for people to get in touch with you to get some of this, some sure. of these pieces yeah. of work? Yeah. Facebook, uh, James Vanderlein or James Alvin Studios on Facebook. And then I also have James Alvin Studios, the website. So what James Alvin Studios dot com. Yeah. All right. So. Well, well, thanks for coming out here Thank today, you. Jimmy. Thank you. And it's some beautiful work. All right. And that's uh, Jimmy Vanderland, a local New Lenox artist. And I'm Rich Olowski here for New Lenox Now.